Here on this channel, we have covered budget capture cards, budget microphones, budget webcams, and I still have to say, even to this day, I'm blown away by not only the innovativeness of these smaller companies, not only reinventing really awesome products, but getting them almost, if not just as good or better than their bigger brothers or what they're trying to resemble. Today is none other than that, but it's also something new, and I haven't seen this except for my original review of this Ampla Rocket as well as the Ampla game. But today we're going to be talking about the microphone you have in front of you that you're seeing as well as what you're hearing. This is the Fifine Ampla Rocket. Let me tell you about it, and uh, RGB is pretty cool, right? Yeah, it's pretty awesome. But before we do that, I need to pay the bills. So here's your sponsor segment for this video. Owned Pro is the plugin that you need for OBS. If you're a person streaming on a PC and you're wanting access to hundreds of overlays and they're continuing to add some, hundreds of different alert packs, DMCA free music through Epidemic Sound, a fantastic chat bot, and so much more jam packed into one single subscription service, Own Pro is the only thing you need. And when you do sign up, make sure you use the link in the description or own.gg slash Cyrus Pro so that you can support the channel. So when you go and upgrade and grab this subscription, you also are helping me continue to do reviews like this. Thank you. Do like many others in the community already have and upgrade your stream today with Owned Pro. Now the Ampla Rocket comes in this fantastic box. Not only is the branding really nice, but this just looks wonderful. And Fifine did send this microphone as well as the A6T or the Ampla game out for review, but they didn't pay for that review, nor will they see this before it goes live. So this is my honest and unbiased review. So let me tell you about it. The Ampla Rocket is a dynamic microphone, kind of like this one that I have here, this is the Rode Pod Mic, but this is also a dynamic microphone, which is good for sound rejection. For example, like right now I'm typing on my keyboard and I'm not sure how much or if any of my mechanical switches you can hear, but it's pretty awesome. It's good for that sound rejection, but what makes this Ampla Rocket microphone so awesome? The RGB, that it makes it better? Does it make it better? It makes it look awesome. Let me just tell you that. On the Ampla Rocket, you have a shock mount that also gets USB-C power, and then you have a button on the top that you can actually uh, cycle through all of the colors. And so you get pretty much, I think it's seven different colors, including just a white, and then you get that natural rainbow like color. And I have to say, I've got my studio lights on, and obviously I'm using a camera that I can adjust like camera settings, but I'm gonna turn all of that off and let you see, those are my RGBs in the floor and this, and it's casting a lot of light. I mean, it really is. So those of you who don't have a lot of light in your situation, this is going to show up on something like a Logitech C920, and it's it's so cool. Not only that, it is a dynamic microphone, so you are getting some really good sound, and you should be getting some good kind of bassy tones from this. It's not a lot of highs, and I would say that my only gripe with this microphone is you will probably need to EQ a little bit of the highs back into it, like plus like 5K, 6K, 7K, those kind of hurts to pull it back in. But it does have mute on the microphone, and you actually just touch the top and you'll see this little smiley face that's creeping right here will turn red to signify that it's been muted. Now what I will say is if you don't like the actual USB and the lights and all that, but you do like the way the microphone sounds, they do sell just this plate. Maybe you can ask them to send you just this base plate. And it's the same thing, but without the RGB, it's the same screw technology as what's on the K683A, the T669, all their other microphones. It's all, I think, the same kind of connection. So if you do like the look of the mic, but not the RGB, you could just turn off the RGB or whatever. RGB makes it sound better, right? At any rate, I have covered several budget microphones and I have to say they are getting to sound awesome. And I have to tell you, please make sure you subscribe to the channel because I'm covering another microphone that gets here tomorrow from Amazon. The company took a picture of one of the most popular microphones on the market and made it. And now it's on Amazon right now for 69 bucks. You can't, you, you can't miss it. So make sure you subscribe, hit the like button and let's like make this video blow up whatever the case. If you want to see more about this microphone and it being compared to the Ampla game and the K683, click the video that's right over here. I'm sure you'll love it. It's a great video and yeah, we'll see you over in that video and uh, 
Please make sure you like the video, please.